All right, so uh, we are on the sand this morning. We're gonna try to catch some halibut. We're gonna try to do it with two different techniques. The first one is with the Lucky Craft flash minnow and the jerk bait technique. And then I also got a weedless presentation. We got the war baits neck breaker. So those are gonna be the two different ways. I got some other ways we need to adjust. We're gonna try to keep it simple. And I'm fishing with some good friends here and I'll walk you through what we're doing. Uh, hopefully we'll be able to pin some fish. It's uh, around 6.30 in the morning and we're gonna try to have a good time. Let's go. All right, fishing next to my friend Robert. And it looks like the water looks pretty dirty. And I'm gonna try throwing the Lucky Craft, but it looks it looks not great. It looks pretty dirty. Maybe it'll get cleans up if you are able to cast a little further out. But we're throwing the Super Glow MVP. But we'll just see. I'm gonna try to find some cleaner water here. I'm on. Small one, but always good to feel the bite. Super small. Monster! <laughs> I think I like seven of these and I'll uh, have myself a legal. <laughs> Woo! Lucky craft. All right. Thanks for letting me catch you, buddy. Got my friend Robert with a Oh yeah, there you go. Yeah, believe it or not, that one's bigger than the one I caught. <laughs> Robert on the drop shot. Robert's killing it. <laughs> Let's yep. get her safely released. Yep, always good to see. Always good, good to get on the board. And then you go from there. Perfect uh, hook set. Let's go get some more. Yep. <clears throat> Dude, I knew something had to be in there. What is that? Oh, it's a calico. Calico, right? Yeah. Calico bass. Nice. What is that right there? Is it rocks? Yeah, I think it's rock. I just took a risk. Yeah. Just cast it over. Yeah, I, I'm, that's what I've been doing. i just casting into it, just seeing what happens. Nice fish. But you, you, when I saw that cast, I was like, dude, he's going to snag again. Because you cast it right over the boiler, so yeah, I'm like, I what's did. he gonna do? <laughs> and, and then and then that's when you get bit. So yeah. it just goes you gotta, to show you. Gotta risk yeah. Gear. Yep. Don't be afraid to snag. Don't be afraid to lose gear. Just you gotta find the fish. That's Ooh, the most important thing. I know you're a spiky one. Nice job, Robert. Woo! It's been uh, three hours that we've been on the sand, and just a lot of exploring, experimenting. Again, just dealing with dirty water, but. Uh, we got a spot here that's filled in real nice and the water's still dirty but I'm gonna be throwing the Lucky Craft and I feel pretty good about it. Let's see if we can pin some fish. I'll talk you through it. Fighter! Small one again. Yeah. So we got a nice little shaker again, really small, but again, we're just fishing really tough conditions, so we'll take anything we can get. Got a little, oh, there we go, quick release. I don't know if that counts. He was up here. <laughs> it's like a 10, 10 inch halibut. It looks like this fish, uh, this beach fish is better at a higher, higher tide. And so that was like my second cast into the structure and Got bit, so good news. Let's try to get bit again. Oh, oh, oh. Is that a fish or not? I'm not sure. It felt like it. Might have been salad. Oh, biter! This one feels a little bit bigger. It's not, it's not a big one, but it's bigger than the ones I've been hooking. Oh, look at you, look at you. You want to fight. Hopefully at least 15 inches. <laughs> Had a little bit of a run right there, but he's on his way in now. But I feel him. Small. 
Nice. Woo! So on the Lucky Craft, flash minnow. Oh, biter! <laughs> oh, he came off! Oh, he's still there. He's still there. He's still there. That's what we say, right? Just keep casting. You never know. <laughs> I'll take it, given how slow it is. Release. Biter! <laughs> that Good was interview. awesome. That was freaking dope, dude. Good interview. Dude, that, that was literally my first fight yeah. here. Like, yeah. I don't know how many casts I've made. I think that's all we can hope for is like, just like picking them off one, one at a time, you know? I don't think they're here thick right now. Oh, Biter! <laughs> yeah. Dude, I'm I'm on a hot streak of really small fish this, the past couple weeks. Really? So many, like, so many small fish, dude. Starting to get into my head a little bit. <laughs> oh man! So I screwed up on the recording. I, I think I turned off while I was recording, so I probably got the hook set. <laughs> I got two really small ones, but it's always good to feel the bite. Just fishing with friends and having a positive attitude. Throwing the Lucky Craft Super Glow MBP, the 110. And uh, we're gonna we'll, we'll keep casting. Maybe there'll be a bigger one here. Uh, maybe Julio will show us uh, how to catch the bigger ones because I seem to be specializing in small fish. So we'll keep going. All right, guys, we're at a uh, new beach, and uh, I think it was a good choice. We, and you always think, hindsight's twenty twenty. Should have probably made the move a lot faster. The water's not brown. Uh, I don't know how much debris is in, but it looks so much cleaner. So uh, we're gonna make some casts. Hopefully, pin some fish. Let's go. Let's go! On the board! A little pancake, nothing big, nothing big yet on this trip, but we're catching little ones. All right, guys, so, got a little short little halibut. No need to take a picture. We know he's short. Gonna let him out. Give him a quick, healthy release. There he is right there. Bye-bye, he's gone. Stinking love fishing, guys, and uh, so very grateful to find a bite. I don't care if it's short, big, doesn't matter. We're here to just have a great time with great people. Um, so super fun uh, to just feel something and eat that lucky craft. So sixth short halibut of this trip, nothing big, but uh, we're gonna keep casting and maybe we'll get lucky with something uh, wor worth talking about. So, but uh, you know, just having an absolute blast and uh, the slow roll on that lucky craft can be so deadly. I uh, just gotta stick with it when times seem tough. Let's go.